Hey guys, Ricardo here and welcome to another Blog Tech Tips. In today's tutorial guys, I'll show you how to on any of um, these Samsung devices or newer Samsung devices, how to install your apps or how to uninstall your apps I should say. Alright, so if you have an app that you want to uninstall on your device, I have a separate tutorial on how to install apps. So this one is specific for uninstalling apps. Now, as you can see here guys, your apps are along here. You can actually scroll over to see various apps and of course um, as a quick guide just in case you want to uninstall this is what you do you might see that there is no options but you can easily go through all right so let me show you how to achieve this on your device so the first thing you want to do guys is go over to apps it's the four circles as a square right here you're going to go ahead and hit with the direction pads to move and okay right here so i'm going to select okay all right, as you can see, we're in the apps um, screen here, which is the all your apps. Notice they are categorized accordingly. And to uninstall the app, go ahead and find the app. So, for example, um, you might see here that you could go ahead and uninstall any app. Sorry, install any app from here. But to uninstall, you'll have to go all the way up here to the settings option up there. So, what you're gonna do is move up. So, keep pressing up on the remote until you see that section above there highlighted go over past search go down to settings you can see it all the way up there go ahead and go into settings and of course here you go and you can see your space it shows you use space which is 398 megabytes of of course 300 and um, available 317.8 megabytes that's 38 percent use so be careful with the space now, of course, some apps cannot be deleted, especially those that came as default. So if you have any third-party apps or any fresh apps that you install from the App Store here, you'll find them in here. So go ahead and move over. So for example, let's say it's not one of the defaults. We'll have to pretend, let's say, for example, um, let's say Netflix. Um, this is a default, so it's locked to the device. It doesn't want it to be deleted. It will stay. But of course, there you go. It can be deleted. So um, any other app that you had installed and the defaults, you can go ahead and choose the delete option. So you can see the delete option there. So once you do, this one cannot be deleted as it's as you see there. It's, it says that this um, base set of apps on your device cannot be deleted. So of course, if it was anything that you installed afresh, it will be deleted from here. So you can go ahead and delete using that option. All right, so I don't have any of those installed right now because of the limited space on my device. So I don't really want to waste the space. So I'm just showing you where to find the option. Um, also, guys, um, if you want to add a app to the home screen, you can also do it from in here. So, um, of course, you can remove apps as a bonus tip. So just find any app. For example, if you want to declutter your screen here, go ahead and beneath the app, say, for example, this sit down arrow. So down arrow. And then you'll see the option to remove or you can actually move it over all right so if you hit remove you can remove an app and to um restore one or add one here that's not here guys just in case you want to spruce up your home screen go ahead and go into um apps once you're in apps guys all right so once you're in apps as in here um you'll have the option to once you open the apps a few times you should get some options so as you can see here, we have um, Prime Video, all of these are installed. Let's use YouTube Kids as an option. You can actually go on a app. And let's say it wasn't installed before. You should have our option if it's installed in some cases to open or, move or add to the um, home screen. So it will show in here once it's installed to add it to the home screen. So you can add it from here. Um, in some cases, the install button here might turn into an uninstall button as well. And of course, Follows fields, um, you can go back to the main screen, guys. And sometimes when you're on apps here, it will show you right up here some apps in your recommended. So you can go up. And once it shows you up here that you have been using long enough, let's say Netflix and it wasn't down here, you can hit up again and you can add it to home screen. So that's why you add it to the home screen. There's some customization options I want to show you there. So that's how to customize um, the TV and the menu. So I kind of went into full on detail and on how to um, uninstall as well as add the shortcut to the home screen and remove it. All right, Ricardo Gardner from Block Tech Tips. Say bye until next time. Bye.